Sorry for the technical difficulties, but the internet went out. Yeah. Um, it's all good. I had though. to give Derek a bath. Yeah, yeah this is my bath time, usually around uh, six o'clock on Sundays. On Only Sundays. Sundays. Yeah. I like I like having a like a nice cloth bath, you know, like a oh yeah, yeah. you know, fill the bathtub up with a little bit of water, and someone cloth bathes me, uh-huh. you know. Yeah. that's what I usually do on Sunday. Derek always calls me because he prefers like one of his good male friends to you yeah, because the, the, yeah, because the the touch of a man's hands on a cloth bath rub yeah. is just on. There's nothing. It's, it's next second, level. It's it's second to none. It's next level, as, you know, as, as, as you say. Actually, you've said that many. I've times. I've said that many times. This is when I'm referring things that are next level. That's yeah, usually yeah. what I'm referring. Remember to. when I asked you if you were gay because you were talking about your love of like femboys? Yeah. And you're like, no, I'm not gay. I'm next level. Remember yeah. That? A, yeah. Yeah. Well, dude, they're like one of the uh, deep uh, Plato's like deepest esoteric teachings <laughs> to commune with God is to yeah. stare at the the bodies of young men. Right. So. You know, makes sense. You took the words right out of my mouth. Exactly. That's Plato. Damn, word. my uh, our soundboard froze. What the what age? What the fuck? All sorts of different. Okay, here we go. Sorry, or we're good. I do. I'm do. I do like this new setup though. This is sweet. Yeah, we're all good. Okay, so let's get back to the subway video. That's where we we were watching. Oh yeah. Um, subway training get... video. All right, we're at the two minute mark. So... Treating customers like friends. Give them talk a, talk behind their backs. Give them a bath. Give them a bath. Cloth. Uh, buy them presents incessantly. <laughs> Derek, Stalk them. That's one of the weird things about you is I always get like these elaborate, like way too expensive gifts from you. you yeah, know? yeah, exactly. I always feel guilty accepting yeah. them. It's like I just I mortgaged my mother's house, so like I, I forged her name to get you this. <laughs> <laughs> it's like a Rolex. Yeah, right. <laughs> and, and then you demand I wear it. Yeah, right. Like, Where's that fucking Rolex? <laughs> Yeah, exactly. Your parents are living in the streets. Yeah, they're living in the streets because they forged her name. And then I'm doing, like, crime for, you know, <laughs> forgery and all this shit. Start by looking to get you a Rolex. Customers have two needs, practical and emotional. Mm-hmm. Filling mm. their practical needs is easy. Make their order. Like they're emotional. <laughs> get back there and jerk them off. <laughs> <laughs> so right, it's, be great. The, it's the practical, humane See, thing to do. This actually would look be a great set for like a '70s porno. It looks like that. it really does. It really does. It really yeah, does. Yeah, like right. you know, like they go and make the sandwich, and they're like, dudes, like hitting with the gr- hitting on with the girl, and it's like, you know what? I'm sick of making sandwiches. I want your sandwich. You know how they have those uh, those pornos where you put your dick in a popcorn box or you yeah, put your dick yeah, in a yeah. pizza box? Uh-huh. How about put your dick in a, yeah, like a Subway, Subway sandwich? Bun. Yeah. Subway Imagine bun. how messy that would be. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> She's trying to eat the sub. Yeah. She doesn't see your cock. And she, she got like extra down. mayonnaise and everything. And your cock's covered in like oregano and mayonnaise and oil. Yeah, right. With like deep, like deep flesh wounds. <laughs> <God>. <laughs> But what if you were rude during their visit? Ooh, I don't know. Yeah. Then the I love the maps, though. You know, because I wonder what the story the maps told. I, like, now, because even when I was a kid, I wonder, like, what do these maps represent? But nowadays, I would be psychotic. I would go into every oh, subway. Because yeah. this is actually probably, once again, this is probably, the, this is probably, like, subway was a, like, a disclosure, like, piece from the establishment to like we're gonna give the people the true history on the subway oh my god how funny would that be all of all of like the elitist secrets yeah yeah right it's uh-huh. like a pedophile yeah like the truth about like map. events that happened like, it's like it's like a map to a, like pedophilic island dude, dude, i could see it i could dude I, I could honestly see yeah i could see that potential oh that's where how, that's how you get to epstein's island you just yeah, right. take the you, fucking yeah you <laughs> you hopefully get footage of the inside of a 1993 subway <laughs> And what's on the walls? We were never paying attention. Because, was... dude, because I remember as a kid, there was like, you know, it was like maps and shit right. like that. And, like, you know, you can see these are like events. I'm sure they have stories behind them. You go into a subway now. Have you ever been in one now? They remodeled all of them. It's like a, de- it's like a death camp. It's just nothing. You yeah. Know? It's just a bunch of nothing. Dude, that's what, that's what, like, honestly, that's probably they, the subway model. They probably got it from, like, ISIS because that's, like, the perfect yeah. just, like, uh killing like center right there like the way subway i love is set up. this is a weird combination of like you're getting a little bit of education and we're also making jokes you know what i mean yeah. you're learning a little bit about yeah. yeah history and then you know i'm making pedophile jokes you know what i mean it's, yeah right exactly that's why this show's uh one of the best it's even like, you know yeah exactly because why do you think these globalists fight wars they don't fight them for the good of america they right. fight it so they could put uh the subway and pepsi in the <laughs> countries <laughs> Right. For real, <laughs> that's like that's that's, just about <laughs> how, that's literally it. All right, let's continue. So uh, they're showing us an example of this employee who's got a bad attitude. So let's see what happens oh, okay. here. Okay. But he ordered a sandwich 
but he didn't get what he wanted. Friendly, quick, trouble-free service. Oh, no. Oh, Filling no. emotional needs is a major part of customer service. Wait, who was the emotional one? I'm confused. <laughs> was it the worker? No, you're supposed her? to feel the emotional needs of the customer. I thought I got, I thought the employee got pissed off. <laughs> I, don't know. I don't. That was like the worst acting. That and also the way they phrase it made no sense. It'd be great. She's like the the customer's on a couch, right? And yeah. you're like sitting there with like a pen and a notebook behind yeah. the, behind the counter at a subway. Yeah, like being their therapist. Uh huh. No, well, not a pen and notebook, just like a, like a little palm calculator. <laughs> right. That's how you just like you take down the notes of your thing just through a palm calculator. <laughs> You want a subway, right? Is that we're not here for your feelings? Yeah, but. right. We're here to <laughs> diagno diagnose your mind <laughs> numerically. Even if you can't fill an order exactly, your customers can still leave happy. As Who brings a pamphlet to a subway? What the fuck? Right? Where would you find a subway pl pamphlet? I don't know. I mean, it's were subs bad. like this revolutionary where people didn't know what the <laughs> fuck they were? It's like, oh, here is flying uh, uh, balloons. Here's airships. People are like, wow, I've never seen this. It's like, here's a Subway sandwich. Wow, I've never seen this. How annoying do you have to be to need a pamphlet to be at a Subway, right? Yeah, right. Just as you would treat friends. Make eye contact and greet people when they enter your store to make them feel Stare welcome. Stare deep into their soul. Hi, welcome to Subway. I'll be with you in a minute. Yeah, don't stop staring. What do you mean yeah. with you in a minute? You're not doing anything. Yeah, it's like, you, you should always be staring at her. He wasn't like, doing He it. walks backwards and everything. You just make sure he... He does the work like this behind his back. Because <laughs> he always makes... He just makes sure to always make con yeah. eye contact. Yeah. See, look, there's like a map of California. Like, what is going on here? I don't know. Maybe there was like the, uh, the, the Sea of California map. Like from the the old ones. That's, see, Derek, that's why I want to get a time machine. Yeah. I wouldn't go back to any other time. I'd go to a subway in '93. Fuck visiting Genghis Khan. Exactly, because I think I would like we would discover the secrets of mankind through right, the walls. Right. Yeah. You know. Only takes seven seconds for customers to get irritated for waiting unnoticed. What the fuck are you doing? <laughs> are you washing your hands, cocksucker? Yeah. Get over and make me food. <laughs> that would be you. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean. Did I can actually see this. Yeah. <laughs> like someday I'd just be so pissed that the person not, like giving me attention immediately I snap at them. That's what you pull out your like your AK forty seven. <laughs> yeah, right. Like dual and it's like somehow <laughs> <laughs> it's their presence with a few words to let them know you know they're waiting. When you're ready, turn to the customer and give him your undivided attention. Thanks for waiting. What can I make for you today? Ugh. Dude, that was terrible, here. dude. You that was so long. Yeah. I would have left. Yeah. If I had to wait that long. He literally could have sat there and bent over and been jerking off for that point. I know. And it looked like he was, actually. Like how slow was that? Right. And so simple, you might not have thought about it. See, this is oh, where wow. pervs get the idea they could jerk off real quick at work. When mm -hmm. they're like, do like pervs, when they're oh, like, pervs. when they're cleaning shit at the sink to think, I could bend over and like jerk off real yeah. quick. And just go. I guarantee that's happened. Like, so. That's what mine sounds like. <laughs> yeah, right. But it's one of the most important tasks you need to perform. I want those Let's yellow counters. To find out right. Why. I'll, honestly, I'd like Plain if those were simple. for sale somewhere, I'd buy. I them. appreciate all the work you've done in here, but I want you to tear it all down, and make it look like a subway from '93. So, dude, you I actually, get that done? Yeah, no joke, I do have a picture that would fit the profile of one of these subway things. It's humongous, and it's of like a, a, a I think Baltimore looking down from like the '30s. Yeah. It's yeah. pretty badass. I, I want you to. I want yellow walls. I want the mm -hmm. maps, and I want like a counter with all the where you put all the. See, because this yellow is like vinyl. It's a vinyl like composite yeah. like over like MDF. Yeah. Which it has that sheen, you know, and then like they got this like, I don't know what you know gauge like stainless is on there, but like pretty thin gauge, but also you know what I mean. Stainless and I want handles. And I want the bread refrigerator, whatever that is, in here instead of the man with the mannequin. Right yeah. behind us, like a bread, yeah, like refrigerator where we bake it fresh daily. You know. Yeah, right behind us. Yeah, because we own, we start running like a subway that just sells the bread. Right. Yeah. Have no meat, no nothing. You yeah. just come get the bread. <laughs> <laughs> but we charge you like as like if this you're is the same it. amount. <laughs> yeah. It's like it's like the same price whether it's just bread or everything <laughs> on it. Shane looks good to customers and gives them the idea that cleanliness is important. It also promotes proper hygiene. Hand washing helps prevent the transmission of bacteria to food. Oh, oh really? Of foodborne illness. I just shoved my fingers <laughs> up my ass. <laughs> when you're a customer, how do you feel when you see counter attendants wash their hands? Don't they usually wear gloves? He's not wearing gloves. Yeah, I know. I don't weird. want to touch it with his fucking weird yeah, hands. Yeah, right. 
He might have still have like jizz particles. Dude, because honestly, I like people nowadays. Even though they're like so, all the shit over there. Probably grosser than ever. Right. It's like, because I'm just going to do this so, like, on TikTok, I could show that I just shove shit in, right. like, like, someone's food, you know? How about when they don't? The hand sink in your subway store is located... We should really the- be teaching people to get over getting sick from eating feces. And right. Because yeah. yeah, that's the problem is, like... I don't know like, why they're not teaching that in the public school. See, that's system. the thing. It's like you're supposed to consume feces and get stronger. Mm. Your body's been able to, supposed to fight that. And you know, use it as a nutrient. Couple we've, feces a day, and we've lost that ability. Keeps the doctor so, so away. So we need to gain that back. Yeah, sure. Dude, I'm looking. Look up, look up fecal matter transplant, man. They solve everything. Exactly. Back counter. This positioning allows customers to see when you wash up and when you don't. And make sure your Winston dick ain't out when you're enough. standing over there. Always Derek would actually take his clothes off and wash his whole body before yeah. he makes the sandwich. Uh-huh. It's like I, you said, you said wash, you said wash up. So <laughs> you didn't say what. And I haven't cleaned in weeks. Yeah, so. right. So like I, I assumed you mean my my whole body, not my hands. <laughs> when was the last time you took a bath? Today. Oh right, I did it. Right, I forgot. It's yeah. Six o'clock. Yeah. Put the soap to a lather. It's it's like 212 degree water. His <laughs> 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 skin, skin is actually like melting. <laughs> Boiling his skin off his hand. Is this clean enough for you? <laughs> you fucking cunt. Rinse thoroughly. He used to make the sandwich with his elbows. Yeah, right. <laughs> the sandwich is a fucking <laughs> mess. <laughs> so damaged. Bandages. <laughs> <laughs> She's like, oh, I want lettuce, olives. I don't want any blood in my lettuce, so make sure you don't like, you know, bleed all out on my fucking sandwich. There you go. <laughs> wow. Now you're ready to make a sandwich. <laughs> We've been talking about washing hands, wash? by the way, for like yeah. five minutes. It's like, well, this is like back in '93, so it's like, make sure to After wipe glyphosate all over your arms. <laughs> Oh, wait. All right, all right. We're going in the men's room. Let's see what happens. Oh, shit. Let me get my fucking... I'm always make sure to check for glory holes. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Best room. After touching your hair, face, or oh, skin... Oh, he's all sweaty. Yeah. After handling money... Dude, because... Oh, now I figured it out. Okay. That was the key to Subway. Since they're in the male bathrooms, there are so many pictures... You had to decipher the code and pick the right picture, and you would get the glory hole. Okay. That's how it had to have worked. Sure, yeah, I mean, it, less... it had to have worked that way. Yeah, absolutely. Only makes sense. I, 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 that I, sounds I, like I solved the problem, honestly. <laughs> I don't know if I'll skip them. And in between preparing different food products. Salami. It's like, here's salami we found in 1956. Still can. <laughs> here is a, That's what it tastes like, by yeah, the way. Here is a spray-painted pepper. <laughs> it's like, That's what their food tastes like. For, like dude, I that, dude, that looks fucked up. I ate at Subway a couple months ago, and it was the worst sandwich I've ever had. I don't care. Remember, no, you were here that day I got it. Remember that? Oh, yeah, yeah. It, dude, I don't care if... Dude, that looks like a spray painted piece of like plastic. We'll see that in the next segment what of this. What the fuck? Make sure to properly spray paint the food. Well, dude, if you're not real person, food. a huge pedophile, of course you're doing like genetically modified foods and all this crazy shit. You know what I mean? I guarantee you, Subway was just a big experiment. Yeah. At the end of the day. Vegetables for slicing. The use of rubber gloves is a topic that frequently arises during any discussion oh, on hand washing. Oh, does it? Yeah, I usually, you know, bring that up gloves. when I'm talking if to people. Worn, Ever thought about, uh, you know, wearing <laughs> rubber gloves when you, wear gloves, when you separate the meat? Stay clean inside, but the outer surface becomes dirty. A dirty glove can contaminate food just as easily as dirty hands. It's like, here's wax paper. Make sure to pack that in real good. <laughs> she leaves it in the sandwich. Yeah, it's like you pack the wax <laughs> paper into the sandwich. And in between preparing different food products like meat and vegetables. Now, let's get what about the child's blood? Where is Ooh, yeah, yeah, where's the child's blood? Right, yeah, how much adrenochrome do I put on is the this, sandwich? Is this, yeah, is this an Illuminati version <laughs> of the uh, <clears throat> um, training video, or, or is there this the, in, the uh, initiate? Thanks for waiting. What can I make for you today? Continue making eye contact as you take orders. I'm gonna Stare make, intently yeah. into their eyes. I'm going to make you have children with me <laughs> on an island 3,000 miles away. <laughs> <laughs> This shows you're paying attention and makes customers feel special. And they're great yeah. and they're great victims too. Is that true? Like when they look at you intently, do you feel special? Oh yeah. Yeah? Okay. Yeah. Just make sure. 
Always Prefer feel special. Customers by name if you know it, and make pleasant conversation with them. Talk about the you weather. You want to see me put my dick in this piece of bread? <laughs> <laughs> Gladys. Yeah. Hey, Gladys. We started up a nice conversation. Want to see my dick in bread? And then talk about the weather afterwards. Yeah. It's like, oh, Boy. so how about those braids? <laughs> <laughs> That's not the weather. <laughs> I know. <laughs> they didn't play too well the other day. <laughs> Family, anything appropriate. Yeah, you're fucking her sandwich, and he's after <laughs> about the braves now. <laughs> Dick sliding in between the fucking bread. Yeah, you know, the cheese. braves were always on TBS. That was like that was always on. Like, dude, like, that was a decade ago. I know. Because <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm just trying to place the uh, you know to time period. Yeah. America's team. Yeah. What if she just went? Oh, oh, she smashed her head to the glass. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Sorry, sir. <laughs> I'm just a me. Good kid. Competition. But also hope no, the glass is so clean. <laughs> 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 she just smashed her face for it. They just keep going on like nothing. Else. Yeah, he doesn't even flinch. <laughs> she she smashes her head through the glass as violently as possible. Uh, he just keeps making the sandwich. Doesn't even look up. Yeah, and then asks up. how the Braves are doing again. <laughs> And she's still hanging in the glass. She, oh my god! Spends waiting for the priest. And above all, oh, Chipper my, Jones. Elf, Chipper and Jones. And act professional at all times. Remember, you're not just selling sandwiches. You're also selling your store's image. You're selling your soul. You're selling what? What did she? What that? Sandwiches and sex parties. I think is what I heard. <laughs> she says <laughs> you're also selling sex parties. Yeah. Okay, hold on. Let me go back. Yeah, I want to hear what actually. What did she act say? Act professional at all times. Remember, you're not just selling sandwiches. You're also selling your store's image. Store's image. Image, because they're giving you maps to pedo playgrounds right, right there. Yeah. That's exactly what they, they had it all planned out. I mean, Damn. Yeah.